with another video. I'm back with another video. Hey YouTube, I'm back with another video and this is episode seven of Car Confession. And I know it's been a minute, I haven't done one, but I was like, let me come back with episode seven. Um, today, we are going to talk about privacy privacy so um for privacy i feel like the biggest thing is not oversharing everything that you're going through um not not sharing your goals and aspirations and everything before you know for sure this is something that you want to do right i feel like when we have things that we want right or that we inspire to have or do we so quick to share right and in that in sharing people genuinely pray on your downfall it's not a joke like it really people really are envious and jealous out here like that's not a that's not a small minute thing like that is very very serious people really do envy other people when they see they they're doing good or even just the idea that they came up with wishing that they came up with that idea right so we must be more private about the things that we do right and the things that we uh say and the things that we share so right we ask, what is privacy? Privacy is the state of condition of being free from obs observance or disturbance by others. The state of being free from public and attention, right? Privacy is important because it gives us the power to choose our thoughts and feelings and who we want to share it with. We should not be sharing everything with everybody, right when you meet someone new you should not be telling them about the things that you're doing and what you're trying to do already like people should earn those abilities right they should earn um the chance to be able to uh be able to for you to be able to share any type of information with them right that should be earned that shouldn't be something that we just be passing out we should be more discreet about the things that we do share we really do. We need to be more discreet about the things that we decide to share. Everything is not shareable. Everything is not shareable. So I want to list seven things that you should not share that should remain private. Right? Because everything as i said everything should not be shared you should be keeping some things to yourself right until you know that it is absolutely final before you decide to share right so seven things family problems relationship issues income and financial situation fears and weakness dreams and goals personal secrets and other people's secrets. Those are seven things that you should keep private, right? Because one, especially when it comes to relationships, right? So say for instance, you, you are in a relationship and your partner does something, right? In that moment to make you upset, make you angry, frustrated, whatever, whatever, right? And you decide to share that with a friend, a family member, whatever. Now they feel like, oh no, this person is not good for you. You don't need to be with them. You don't need to be doing it. Now they have an opinion, right? So that's why it's important to be discreet about the things that you do, the thing, the people that are you are experiencing life with. Um, and you shouldn't share too much about personal things, you guys. You really shouldn't. A lot of that should be private. You should be keeping that to yourself because of other people's opinions and um, discouragement and things like that. It comes with so much when you share, right? When you're sharing things with other people, it comes with so much. 
Be mindful in the things that you share. Know that this person that you're sharing this information is trustworthy. Trust is a big thing when it comes to privacy, right? Because I have to trust you to be able to share some vulnerable information with you right the things that you should be sharing though these are four, the four things, things that you should share that you should share that should not be private that should be out in the open so people know um abuse if you are in any type of abusive relationship whether that be mental emotional physical please please i encourage you to speak out right i know that is a hard thing because of what the uh the abuser could do to you but suppressing and not um being vocal about those emotions that you are feeling is damaging to your mental health whether that be mentally or physically right because those those mental emotions that you don't deal with they manifest into physical things whether that be back pain neck pain um insomnia those things happen when you don't speak about the things that are happening for you so i encourage you to speak up when things are happening don't have that in private Someone needs to know. Talk to a counselor. Talk to a friend. Talk to some family members that you can trust. Right? Number two, if you are depressed or have any other mental issues, this does not have to be shared with everyone, right? But the people that you trust and that you love and know that that has your back and in your best interest that's definitely something that you want to share because they can also help you in bettering your mental health or even suggest someone that can also help you right another thing another thing that you should not keep um private is when it is unruly pay or un unrightfully pay like if you're not you're getting underpaid right and and you're not making the um same amount as the next person that is working whether that be a man or woman right definitely speak up definitely speak up in the workplace when something is not right right whether you being bullied whether you're being overlooked Make sure to speak up. That should not be private, right? Because wrong is wrong, right is right. And people should be called out on their shit, right? And my last thing that you should also share, but not with everyone, is your dreams and goals, right? Be sure about your dreams and your goals before you decide to share with them. Be sure that you are 100% fully invested into these goals and dreams before you decide to share right that way that no one else have any type of way of to um to deteriorate you from what you are trying to do right because you already have it set in stone in your mind that this is something that i want this is a goal that i have this is an aspiration that i am going for right that is when you can share otherwise keep it private be able to have um discernment and intuition when it comes to people right that way you know mm, i don't think this person is for me i shouldn't be sharing too much and be sure to not overshare you guys be sure to not overshare when you notice yourself saying too much back up a little bit right back up a little bit we shouldn't give everybody everything right when we first meet them or have their interaction for a couple of times we should develop something over time before we decide to spill our guts but i hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you constantly for all the support i appreciate it so very much 
But don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and hit that notification bell to so get notified every time I post. See you guys in my next video.